today on the Superbrick Building channel, I'm going to celebrate getting 50 subscribers with a big sign and some fireworks. So first, I'm going to start by showing you how to build a sign. First, you're going to need a pillar up so you can have a place to build your sign. Leave one block floating midair so you can have a little block to place the blocks for your sign on. Once you have your sign built, all you need to do is make a square out of some blocks. For this sign, I'm going to build an outline of the sign out of some andesite. Then surround your sign in redstone lamps so you can have your sign light up like my 50 subscriber sign. Then you'll need to place observers all around your sign just like this. The bottom ones can be facing any way you want and the top ones need to be facing the opposite way as the bottom ones and the ones on the side need to be facing up or down. At the top, make sure one of the top observers has the little face on top. So I'm gonna just place some observers just like this. So as you can see here, the arrows of the observers need to be pointing in a clockwise or counterclockwise position. Now if you go over here to the top, you can see that the observer face is facing upward. Just place a redstone dust on top of it and build a platform right next to it just like this and after you're done with the platform place a redstone comparator facing that way then place a hopper just like this so it's facing this way then place a hopper right here and another hopper so it was facing that hopper and keep doing this until the hoppers face into each other after you're done doing all that you'll need to place a block outside of the hoppers and place a daylight detector down just like this. If you want it to turn on at night, make sure it's white. And if you want to turn it on in the day, make sure it's blue. Now you need to place some observers down under here like this. So the arrow of the observer is facing into the redstone lamp. It's kind of hard at the sign angle like this. So we're going to do it from below so you can see the arrow and it's easier to place. Now you'll need to do the same thing on the sides and going upward just like this. When you get to the top, make sure you place the observers just like this. And again, when you get onto the side, you can just place the observers like I did right here. And it looks like these observers aren't working very well, so I need to go break them and replace them again. Yep, it looks like they're going to work now. Just go and place them back, place them back up just like this. And then we're going to go and place the observers back onto the side of the thing. So just place it like this and make sure the arrow is facing into the redstone lamp. Then just turn it to nighttime and then it will light up. Oh, I forgot. You got to put an item in the hopper for this to work. Now that we have the item in the hopper, you can see that it's working and the lights are going around our little sign. So now that we're done with this sign, we're going to go over to my 50 subscriber sign. And thank you so much for helping me get to 50 subscribers, but I don't think it's good enough. I think we got to get to 1,000. And you can see here that I made a bigger redstone hopper clock because this is a bigger sign. And it's the same concept as the other sign, just bigger and with a bigger clock. And you can see the daylight sensor, the comparator, and the redstone and all of the observers and everything. So I want to take a moment here to showcase some of my subscribers and thank you so much for subscribing because it really helps me out a lot and I'd really like to get to a thousand subscribers. And if you want to be featured in some of my other videos, make sure to subscribe to Superbrick Building so I can feature you in some of my future videos. And make sure to hit that like button too. Now what's a celebration without fireworks? I'll teach you how to make a firework machine. So first, you'll need a dispenser filled with fireworks. Then, you'll need two hoppers, a lever, a redstone comparator, and a lever, and a, not a lever, but a repeater. So, place down a hopper like this, and then a hopper like this, and then a hopper like this, so the hoppers are facing into each other. Place a comparator going into the hopper, and then a repeater, and a dispenser filled with fireworks. Then. Make sure you fill with fireworks and put an item in the hopper and the dispenser will start shooting off fireworks. To turn it off, just 
just flick the lever and it will turn off. To turn it back on again, just flick the lever again and then the dispenser will start shooting fireworks again. Well, thanks so much for helping me get to 50 subscribers. I really like that. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and say hi in the comments. Don't forget to leave a like on this video too.